And then I'll start every new day, um, once we walk to work. <clears throat> or should I? No, I'll start every new day here, because I guess this is the next day's newspaper. Anyways, Gretzen checkpoint a success. Entry re uh, restrictions to relax. Admit foreigners. So now we're going to be admitting foreigners now. Analysts upbeat. Increased trade and co uh, cooperation predicted. So let's walk to work here. November 24th, 1982. Okay, so from day, from today, foreigners with a valid passport and uh, permitted valid passport are permitted to enter. The Brutes hardware inspection are now installed. Check all passports information carefully for discrepancy. Deny an entry with inconsistent information. So now it has inspect mode. So basically, we click on this and then we can inspect any two things. Tell us if it has correlation, if it's um, matching data, if it's uh, discrepancy detected so you'll see that there and then the rule book has more stuff now too I'm not gonna go through all that so basically this is where we're gonna start be using our rule book and a rule book is our most used tool and it's one you should always have here on your little table whatever this is whatever you want to call it so it's our first person so we gotta make sure the date of birth is somewhat realistic I mean you can never tell what the date of birth is obviously but as long as it's before the actual date in this corner here he's male he looks like his picture um, we're gonna go to import make sure that one's the right city and it expires after this time if it expires before then it's obviously it's a discrepancy so you can't let them through next person okay male yeah so what am I looking for? That one. Yep. 82. 10. Hold up. It's expired. <clears throat> Let's ask the person about that. Must be a typographical here. So you got to look through everything. And then obviously when you get more information, you have to check literally everything. And it just gets... Worse and worse, kind of progressively. Probably, uh, that's a false place. Passport has false information, and that means you're not getting in. Like I said, I'm gonna try to do this with their job intact, so we'll see how this goes. Papers, please. Um, female, East Creston. I'm pretty sure that's a place, yep. 84. Does look like her picture. She was over there hounding us, but. Like I said, if you wanted to read this, you're gonna have to do it yourself, because I'm gonna be paying more attention here, especially on later levels. Looks like her picture. Female. 84. It's all good. Next. So far, we've ran through five people. So, so far, so good. Uh, 53 female, Orchard, yep, 83, it's good. She also just handed us something, I'll show you guys that in a second. Pink Vice, 1603 for East Greston for all your fantasies. Some kind of brothel. Okay, so, 42 female. She doesn't really look like her picture. Let's ask about that. And something's going on. This guy just jumped the fence. That's cool. This guy has a horrible shot. That's cool, too. Apparently, he only has one gun or one bullet. And he just got bombed. I guess this is going to affect our pay. The day was cut short by a terrorist attack. Progress is saved at the start of each day. Yeah, go figure it. So we only made 30 bucks there, which is kind of bad because our daily expenses are $50. So we're 30 bucks. Uh, we have 30 bucks now, but uh, at least we have something. That means I only have to make 20 to make sure I can get everything for the next day. So 